Now, bef- before we get to the bulk of the show, just to be clear, this is going to be a different type of show. It's episode 161. Uh, is it a, are you, you're oh, you're showing me. Oh, that's very nice. It's very sharp. Um, I had written about two pages of the podcast, two and a half pages, until my uh, livelihood was taken away from me. Yeah. So this is going to be a different sort of show. Originally, I was going to just wanted to make it like a special edition and just talk about that. But dang it, what I wrote was funny. Yes. I understand. <clears throat> so I want to get through this. And the stuff that I wrote was really good. And I just want to get through that. And then we can talk about other things. So so before we get to the bulk of the show, there was a small bit of news that caught my eye. My ire. Stop. I, my, my eye and my ire. I had to clarify that it, it, to have those two words next to each other is yes. difficult. I and ire. I-R-E. So, so people are eating Tide Pods, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. People are eating Tide Pods. Because because just a shit ton, shit ton, honey, shit ton, because a shit ton of people will go out of their way to do stupid crap as long as people watch it on the internet. Yes. Basically, the internet has turned millennials into the cast of Jackass. Yes, very much so. Yeah. But that's not the story. The real story concerns New York State. <clears throat> so the governor of New York State has, has decided to Stop the Tide Pod menace. Okay. But unfortunately for us here at the Pope on Film Podcast, New York State's plans do not include making a black and white remake of Reefer Madness, but with Tide Pods. Ah. Uh. Wonderful. That's a great idea. Man, yes. Bring pods. And he's just eating the pods and the girl... Quit that crazy laughing. Yeah, I'm just saying it would work. Yes, but, okay. Tide pod man. Yes, but when we get to the scene of how you can flash back from Tide Pods and it's just people on Halloween masks. Yeah. Sonny Bono cameo right Ab- there. Sonny Bono. Sonny, yeah. We'll dig yeah. him up, push 100,000 volts through him. Yep. I mean, he's only got to jerk around a little. That would count as acting. Again, yeah. Stallone. You yeah. know, yeah. And and, and he could, he could be he could he could be the flashback. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So so this is New York State's plan to stop the Great Tide Pod Menace of 2018. Verbal copyright 2018. The Pope on Film Podcast. All rights reserved. <laughs> so. So legislators in New York State have drafted a bill that would force companies to stop manufacturing visually pleasing laundry detergent pods. Okay. Specifically, they said that their law would force people to create laundry detergent, and I quote, in a uniform color that is unappealing. Brown, for example. <laughs> you racist SOBs. Yes, I will give you that, but I have more there. Go ahead. Dare you, New York State. Oh, yeah, we'll make the Tide Pods brown because nothing attractive can be brown. Gee, thanks, Dad. Yes, yes. If this was 1781, I would duel <laughs> New York I would challenge New York State to a duel. We do it in Weehawken because everything is legal in New Jersey. Okay, but but this also means that New York State. I I am sure maybe there was some kind of a, an emergency panel or something like that. New York State looked at this tie pod, tied pod situation, and determined that. Tie pods were too sexy. Yeah, yeah. So then, so then, let's stay on Tide pods. That's why it, people are eating them. Yeah. So Tide pods have now they have these commercials that are lit in very soft colors and has you know the same 
uh, tender, loving, breathy woman who talks about depression and pill ads. Yes. Tide Pods now introduce child safety packs <laughs> to protect your children from Tide Pods. Because we care about safety. Um, excuse me. No one is freaking out because two-year-olds are getting Tide Pods. <laughs> It's 17 year olds with YouTube accounts. Yeah. So you don't need child safety packages. You need teen safety packages. <laughs> like a teen tries to open up the Tide Pod uh, container, but then the Tide Pod container says, okay, first, let me see your credit score. Yeah. <laughs> like, oh, man. So, so do you ever catch like Amber or. Um... What's the other jewel? Emerald. Uh, <laughs> sneaking around the kitchen at all? Looking for Tide Pods? Yeah, in the middle of the night, trying to score. All, all, all the time. Yeah. But, but let's, let's be honest about, 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 the, about Tide. Uh, S.C. Johnson, maybe. I'm not sure. A, let's just forget the name of the company. Let's just talk about the people who make Tide Pods. Um, you got to know that they're loving this. Yes. Right. You got to love you got to know that there are uh, men in a boardroom that are super excited that literally everyone is talking about Tide Pods. Exactly. And doing stupid things. And it's not their fault. You can't you can't really pin this on them. Yeah. You know? Yeah. I am currently drinking uh, my first Tecate light of the evening. Ah, podcast of the Pope on film Tecate light it's just like original Tecate but it doesn't burn your mouth <laughs> Tecate light now in non-battery acid flavor <laughs> okay. 